Hi, so my name is Adriana Markowitz and I wanted to make a quick video on a little bit of a backstory on me and my unique journey so that others know that it's possible and that everybody's story is different so don't compare your journey and your story with somebody else's because everybody's is different. So um, a couple of things that I want to start with is that I want to go back to when I was 18 and when I met my husband we are high school you know sweetheart so to speak and um, we he was 17 I was 18 and we um, ended up having kids uh, when I was 21 we had our first son when I was 21 we got married when I was um, 20 and he was 19 and I had my first son Josh little Josh at 21 and then I had my youngest son Bradley a couple years later so I wanted to be a stay-at-home mom and so that was just like the only option for me I wanted to stay at home with my kids and that was that so um, I was a loan processor at the time and I just stopped working there as soon as I had my first son and um, that was that. So as I was a stay-at-home mom, we were only on my husband's income. And as a lot of you moms out there know, it's, you know, it gets tight on just one income. However, we always made it work. We always had family to support us and stuff like that. Um, but, you know, it was always really hard. But we sacrificed because I wanted to be a stay-at-home mom. So, um... I tried a couple of direct sales companies. I tried a vitamin company, I tried a food company, I tried a jewelry company, and then I came across Unique. So I came across Unique last November. Um, somebody introduced me to it and I signed up and um, basically what happened was I got off to a pretty good start. Um, I loved the product, I enjoyed the company. Figuring out about the sisterhood was amazing. That was a bonus I had no idea about. I had been in other direct sales companies before, but I had no idea. This was such a treat to really, really be a part of um, such a brand new company. Um, I was number 5,000 uh, something. So 54, what is it, 54 or something? Um, I can't remember right now, of course, but um, yeah, it was amazing, and the sisterhood is amazing. It's unreal. Other direct sales companies, um, people, women in other companies actually write me even now, and they're like, you know, really, the sisterhood is amazing, and they've heard about it, and they're interested in it, and they're drawn to that um, for a reason. We're, we're positive. We want to uplift women and validate women and empower women, and that's what it's really about, and really, that was my passion always, like my whole life, was to help women, um, and, you know, even like children, and just, I love to help people and make people feel great about themselves, so, um, um, when Unique came, it just, it literally um, was just meant to be, I feel like, because it was both my worlds just collided into this one great, beautiful baby that was unique. So, and it was an amazing opportunity, and it still is an amazing opportunity. So, um, you know, I just, I try to tell everybody about it so everybody knows and they can benefit from it. Um, women just like me, um and it's amazing to watch and that's the most gratifying is really helping these women um, and helping myself you know achieve the goals that we've always wanted uh, while being able to stay at home with our family um, so anyways um, I got off to a strong start and then I ended up getting kind of a little stagnant and my sponsor ended up um, becoming inactive I didn't have a lot of guidance um, so I rolled up to the amazing Kanisha Morrison and boy was I lucky because when she jumped in and um, I became her first line, 
Um, and she was able to help me and train me and guide me, which is really important to be able to have a sponsor that's available to answer any questions when you might have them, um, you know, and really be rooting for you and helping you and guiding you. Um, that's really important. So you want to make sure that you're doing that for everybody. Um, so I rolled up to Kanisha, um, and I was kind of in a stagnant place and, um, she got me motivated, geared back up, you know, we talked, uh, chatted on the phone, and, um, you know, we were kind of gung-ho from there. I really, um, I decided to quit my part-time job that I had gotten, um, that I started in January. I started that in January, so a couple months after, um, I got this to even, you know, just uh, bring in even more income and put it towards my unique business. So I was excited about that. Um, however, it's not something that I wanted. The commute was a lot. It was not, not something that I enjoyed. Um, I enjoyed staying at home being able to make my own hours, work from my computer, be here for my family whenever I needed, be able to go back and forth to my kids' school if I needed, and, uh, you know, my sister's house and family, be able to visit family when I wanted, and um, do work on my own time. So um, I decided to quit that job and really go, go full for force with Unique. And Actually, also, in the process, I got picked to be in the catalog. So, um, I did fly out to Utah, and I got to meet Melanie. That was an awesome experience, and um, I got to be in the catalog. So, that helped a little bit, too, keep my motivation. But, you know, other than that, that was a great experience. But other than that, that wasn't, you know, um, anything. But I, you know, got to... Um, connect with Kanisha and she really motivated me and I, I decided that I wanted to do this full time and I wanted to make this happen. So I quit my job and I seriously spent the next couple of weeks really, really, really working on my business. I didn't sleep. I didn't eat that much. I was just pushing forward, pushing forward every single day. I was messaging everybody talking to everybody, handing out my card whenever I could, um, following up with people, being um, very connected with people, personal messages, all of that. And I was doing what Kanisha was telling me to do, using the scripts, using the files, um, listening and watching successful people that have made it to the top. I have been watching them and trying to duplicate what they're doing because that's what successful people do. They watch successful people and they duplicate what they do. And that's what's going to make you successful. So um, then let me see. Was there anything else that I needed to touch on? Um, I think that's pretty much it. So... I think I basically touched over everything, so um, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. I just wanted to go over a couple of things so that you guys knew a little bit about my story and the struggles that I've come from, um, just so you guys know that you can make it work. You really, really can. Um, you have to put in the work. You have to put in the time. It's not... Um, you know, it's easy, but it's, you know, it doesn't come, nothing comes without a little bit of sacrifice and dedication and drive. And you have to believe in yourself. Like, I believe in you because I believe in you and I believe that you can make this happen. Okay. It's, it has nothing to do with anything else. Everything is laid out for you. The products are amazing. The comp plan is amazing. You are amazing. And you can make this happen if you are talking about it, you are posting about it, you're out there, you're getting out of your comfort zone, okay, and you're making it happen. You have to want it as bad as you want to breathe. And as soon as that happens, that's when you'll make it happen in your own business because that's what happened to me. I wanted this so bad, like seriously, I could not breathe. 
and that's what that's what made it happen and you have to have that drive that force to push you forward so I just want you to know that you all can do it it is possible for all of us it's all laid out there for us to succeed so um, I just want us all to keep pushing forward work together our team is amazing um, so if you want to join our team um, then go ahead and click the link below um, and I'll post that up for you we are very close tight knit team and we're very positive and encouraging and we motivate each other and help each other and praise each other and that's how I want all of us to stay.